here we have once again Western Koreans with their A star lineup because this time it doesn't have sloth. So well, it looks like we're going to be starting off with attack on Eichenwalder. Western Koreans' uh, weakness on this map is uh, Junkrat being bummed by him at the choke. Uh, Arisa we have some trouble with, but let's see what they're trying to do to counter that. So looks like Annie's going to be going on Anna. Ha ha ha! See what I did? Uh, because apparently we're not fussed about winning today. Uh, apparently we've got Kinku on Zen because apparently we aren't fussed about winning today. Ooh. And we got Tyler on Soldier with a Naf skin. Uh, oh, then Ryan Diva, fair enough. So uh, they've got oh and Junk Pass. They got a fair bit of distance, so maybe I'm um, gonna we'll see if they. It looks like it's gonna be a shield war, but oh my god, the blue team have got a full cunt lineup of Zarya, Brigitte, all that shit. Anyway, anyway, Tanya leading the charge. Rasmus close right behind her. Oh, looks like they're going in around the left, around the mega, trying to shorten the distance. Now Tanya peeks and does she, oh my god she misses the trap by complete luck because I know she did not see that and she walks straight in and they are just a poke battle at the moment but no they're not going to rotate left, they're going to push in straight in but they've lost their Reinhardt and they've lost the uh, Hanzo and the Zarya, yep that's not looking good for the ship blue team. Okay I'm starting to think if the rest of the games are like this we're not going to have a game where I can lose so guys be a bit shitter. And then Kinku just fagging out, hitting off the Ziri. Not, not, not bad at all, not bad at all. So, six minutes to push this and penetrate the doors over there. But shit blue team snip. Oh, still, still going with the same thing. It looks like Josh is going on, uh, on Anna as well, so no one wants to win this game. Oh my fucking god. Camille, I said we need to make Josh look bad, not fucking let him fag out. Anyway. Blue team pushing in. Western Koreans backed into a bit of a corner there. Very aggressive thing by the Reinhardt, but Annie with the clutch sleep. And their Junkrat's down, so that's going to be a lot of spam lost. Western Koreans pushing in still. Slowly moving the payload forward, but unfortunately Tanya's down as well due to the shit can't hand so. But Rasmus takes down the Zarya. She's really not going to be able to get much charge today. And then Kinku's down as well, unfortunately. And as Rasmus is out of his mech. And I think we just need to run back there a little bit. Okay, so we've got a uh, Junkrat tie of Shatter, Nano Vite. We've got a lot of ults coming in from Western Koreans. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if Tanya got a fat fucking Shatter and then Tyler sprayed everyone on the ground. Now, but first let's see what Camille's uh, tie is like. Where is it? Okay, it's over there. And it was absolutely fucking incredible. Camille, teach me. Teach me how to flag out like you. Now, let's see what this shit Junkrat does. Okay, Tanya shattering. Oh, I'm afraid we lost three people, but oh, a fat, bu a fat bomb by Rasmus. But again, you committed two ults after half your team had died, so you know. I think maybe maybe better uh, communication on that time. But you know what, guys? I still still uh, trust you. You can still pull it back. But I mean, I'm not going to make fun of you too much because you're not Sloth or Tyler. So got got to be nice to you. Are we missing someone? Oh, there we are. Rasmus switched on to the Zarya. He loves his women nice and meaty, and now he's going to choose them. So, pushing through the choke. Hanzo just uh, spamming in a little bit. And, uh, oh dear, Ziri takes out the junk rat. I'm starting to think maybe a uh, Farrah would to really help the uh, Western Koreans, but either way, they're just pushing around. They're still making progress on the payload. The ship blue team having to push up a little bit, but oh dear, that is unlucky. Tanya gets booped out of the way and they are all fucking flattened. But Rasmus somehow gets away. Obviously they didn't think he was important enough to, you know, warrant finishing off, but I don't know, he might he might have uh, been able to save some charge. Let's see if he's glowing at all. I can't fucking see Oh my god, can you stand still? There's not even anyone shoot fuck off. I'm not even trying. Alright, there we go, see. Switching onto a fire. But without without the mercy, so you know, he's, he's going to have to be quite self-sufficient, but hopefully Annie can land her shots. Again, Ziri's uh, just up there laying down spam, not really getting much, uh, but, alright. Not, not, not really anyone behind Tanya's shield, so, but now they're pushing forward. Ship blue team are having to retreat. They've got Hanzo and uh, Anna at the back. Oh dear, but that is a pick by Camille. Oh, unfortunately, no joy on the shatter by Tanya, blocked by uh, the ship Ryan, and now they've nanoed him. Is he looking to shatter? No, he's just going to... Oh, okay. But now a nano visor from Kingle. And an absolutely shite graph. What the fuck was that? 
Oh dear, but that is a fat nade by... I mean, that's a shit nade by Josh. Uh, and then Camille was able to just clean it up because Josh did such a shit nade. But now Hanzo's coming from the back, so I'd watch out. Oh dear, that's filthy. Oh dear, that's filthy. He is fucking you from behind. Vazmus, take him on. It's 1v1. You can beat a, Han you can beat a Hanzo. And a junk rat. Oh! <laughs> it, was <laughs> it came down to a slapping fest, but... The big beefy woman lost to the skinny fucking hobbled Australian who also has like fetal radiation syndrome. Anyway, bringing out the Faro Mercy and he's obviously had enough and decides she wants to win. So, pushing in now. Still got a minute 48 and uh, just coming up to the bridge now. Maybe some uh, fat boops coming from Faro. But uh, Hanzo, Hanzo gets a sca uh, scout arrow. See what go on. And now he drops down. Oh, Kinku. Go on, take him, take him. Oh, but that's, that's unfortunate timing from Rasmus. Not really any follow-up on the thing. Oh, apart from Tanya, who's fucking carrying it herself. And Tanya again with the fat shot. Oh, my God. K Josh, you lucky bastard. Someone get Josh. He's literally just there. He's literally just there. There we go. Good fact. Look at that. All right. Anyway, stuff's going on, apparently. Uh, oh, not really. Are Western Koreans going to be able to touch? Or a ship blue team going to... Uh, make a defence. Oh, look, look, Hanzo's coming round, and Zarya is on the other side. Oh, but Hanzo's not long for this world. Took him a bit too long to get his teammates in there. And a block by Tanya. Absolutely fucking clutch. No one got from Western Koreans. And now a barrage from Camille. Get in, Brigitte. You know what? We'll take it. We're not committing another ult, are we? Uh, I mean, fair enough. I mean, I think we probably could have got away without using that, but always better safe than sorry. And then a Hanzo halt. To be fair, at least they wasted theirs as well. Now, are they going to break the doors down? Okay. Western Koreans getting on to the last point here. We've got two minutes. I mean, making good progress, making good progress. Uh, no, Annie's almost got her Valk up, so that might be able to push it through, but he'll, she'll need to watch out for the Brigitte and the, uh, and the, what's her name? The big Russian woman. Zarya. I should know, I play her. Anyway, uh, Tanya. Just holding the ground on the side. Unfortunately, a bullshit charge from uh, from there, Brigitte. But it's a bit too late because they're Reinhardt shitter than ours and died. Because Tanya's a fucking monster and they can't compete. Anyway, uh, Western Koreans making a bit more space. Camille having a little sleep. I can almost guarantee Josh didn't mean to hit him, but fuck it, you know. Oh, and then unlucky from Camille. Just yeah. But Mercy's getting the res on Camille, but she'll want to watch out for that tire. Oh, and the tire's disgusting. Yep, run away, lads. Not worth it. Get the fuck out of there. No, just wait. Oh, it's right. There's, there's Aria's not even got any charge, so it's not like we have to wait for her to cool off. Jesus. If I, go on, look for the boop. Look for the boop, Camille. Oh, no. Overextended a lot, but... There's only a minute left. Only a minute left, and we've got... Got a lot of ults coming up from the uh, Western Koreans, and not a single... Not a single proper defensive ult, actually, coming from the ship blue team. So, if uh, if Camille is able... If Rasmus is even uh, able to get a good grab... This could be quite devastating. And Alani pushes in with her uh, trans. Uh, no ground gains yet from Thingy. Oh, oh, that is unfortunate. But Camille with... No, not Camille. K Kinky with the clutch trans to save it. Oh dear, unfortunately. You can't save that. But it's alright. They've used all the ults. Don't commit anything. Western Koreans, drop back. That's fine. That's exactly what you want. Now they've got a junk rat thing and that's it. And unfortunately, Ani did use her, uh, for her Valkyrie, but it's fine. It's fine. We've got a grav, we've got a barrage, that's all we need. Just And we've got a, we got a visor and a shatter, so fucking hell, we're stacked. And Kinku has switched on to cancer herself. We hope she can recover. Anyway, Tyler, Tyler runs in, but oh dear, here's an unfortunate... Oh, that's shit. Okay. That is a funny old barrage, but yeah, we've got this a few kills. Western Korean still able to push it, but unfortunately Junkrat's getting a couple kills. But go on, Tanya, smack him up, smack him up, smack him up. Rasmus should be making short work of that junk route. should be getting a lot of charge off him. It looks like he's still yeah, not not the highest charge, but still. Gives that they've made space, giving time for Annie to run back. Here comes Annie on her Moira. Here to save the day. Oh dear. Oh, and Tanya's been point, uh, isolated by the May. But unfortunately a clutch bubble from Rasmus saves him. And is that our Oh, Tyler coming through! Tyler coming through with the visor and gets nothing. So but still, Tanya's making up for his shit fucking performance. Uh, oh, but, yeah, but that's another wank nade by Josh that doesn't get anything. And because of that, Rasmus is able to just pick him up. Western Korean's getting really close to the thing now. But Mei's being a little bitch and just freezing herself. Oh, but uh, oh, a clutch stun from Kinku. Completely shutting down the uh, the 
I don't know, what's Brigitte's thing called? Oh, and Reinhardt's just there in time, but ch uh, Testicles is going to smack that fucker up. And that uh, Sid shouldn't be lasting long with Rasmus. So, 300 hours, and you just about touch, and that's it. But it's alright, Rasmus saving the, saving the team from the tyre anyway. Overall, a good performance. A nice nice uh, three three checkpoints, so... And then what have we got? No, no time left, so... Western Koreans better hope they hold, but let's see what often often there uh, we like to run a hog reso on defense and then maybe get a bit of spam so I have a feeling that might be be what we've seen uh, the uh, ship blue team they didn't they didn't actually run any diva despite having their diva um, enthusiast we'll call it to be polite uh, so maybe they'll either go for a Ryan Zarya Brigitte again or you never know they might go for something a little bit more mobile now if I was Okay, so we got a uh, Farrah Mercy, we got a uh, Ryan Zarya. Yeah, no, no, not not a bad comp. And there's the Diva. Hang on, but you've got you got Sid on the Zarya and not the Deep. You know what? Whatever the fuck, it's not it's not my team. Why am I trying to tell them what's what? Here we have Camille. Oh, hello there. That's Josh getting up high, and we got Camille on the the Cree. We got yep Hogwarts there, as I called it. Kinku, ready to fucking flag out. Oh, it's like she knows I'm there. Can you see me? Do you feel my presence? Not if you not if you know I'm here. Yeah, I think I think that was a small nod there. See me and Kinku are just like that. We're just so like interconnected. You can't like Yeah. Now what else have we got? Rasmus in the nice uh, blubbery skin. Bit of a shit one from Camille, can't I? So so hope he's uh, not affected by that doesn't affect his ability. And Tyler playing the most skilled hero in the game. Oh my fucking god. Jesus Christ. As oh okay, I thought you got it with one of his balls, but no, it wasn't mine. Camille uh T Tyler's balls are not that dangerous. Okay. Foul Mercy uh, extending on to the right, so uh, might want to be able to shut them off early, but oh dear, that's Camille down. That's going to be really difficult to fight the Farrah Mercy now. Well, no res coming from the Western Koreans, and t and Kinku's down. Oh, that's really not good for Western Koreans and the Junkrat and the tank. And now it's just Rasmus and Annie just fighting around. But I think you might want to die as quick as possible to avoid giving them all that charge. But you might be able to get one of the long spawn, but nope, that's both of them down. And I think it's fair to say. Point one is going to the ship blue team. Any changes made from Western Koreans? Yep, we've got Camille coming onto the Genji, his speciality. Got Rasmus coming onto the Diva and Tanya. Oh, we're going to a full dive here. Okay, I, I like it, I like it, I like it. Now, what else have we got? We've got Ziri coming up with a barrage and fuck all for Western Koreans because we've changed half our team. So, Farrah Mercy sneaking up round the left. Let's see. Oh, Camille spotted him. So, oh, he gets he gets a deflect on one of the rockets, but not, not really anything, anything hit scan to deal with that. You can... You're gonna have to hope to Tyler out uh, out Farrah Mercy's him, but I've got I've got full faith in him as long as he doesn't press Q in the middle of a game. Oh, you got you got lucky there. Rasmus ran out of DM just as Tyler got his uh, deflect up. I noticed that. Don't don't think you did that on purpose, Camille. Uh, Rasmus, I noticed. Fucking hell, I can't get your names right. All right, a hey, bomb coming in and it gets fucking nothing because it's shit. But that's the Diva, the Tan uh, Tanya, and the uh, Genji all down, and he might want to run away. Yeah. I don't think this is going to go west to Western Korean. So you need to group up, lads. We've had... Go on. <sighs> Tyler, I think you just got to accept your fate. If, I mean, when I said it, at least bowing out and dropping down would be more... Wait, what? Sorry, I was about to chat shit about how you died to a mercy, but I think that takes precedent. Okay. Camille just having a look, seeing Wagwan. Uh, still no charge or anything for Sid. Are they able to touch? Western Queen is just able to touch, cutting it a bit close, and they force out the Valkyrie, which I think they'll take. Uh, they got a uh, Dragon Blade coming out. Let's see if Camille's able to get anything. He uses it off cooldown, and what does he get? He gets. Uh, oh, he, he gets a he gets a Diva Mech. Not bad, but that's the both tanks uh, down from the Western Koreans, and then the support, and then the tank down for good. And oh, what the fuck! Both towers popping off, and oh my god, does Tyler save this? Does Tyler save this? No, he doesn't. He gets fucked. But still, I uh, got a few point kills out of it, but you know, I just 
They only spawn over there. Like, but anyway. Now, West Koreans, at five minutes, they have to hold uh, this bit here, and they are going up against a death ball comp with a dive in a corridor. I have a feeling this is going to go fantastic, but let's have a look. Camille sw swatched on to, uh, swooped on <laughs> swapped onto a Reaper, and Annie pops the Valk, going to initiate with that. Tanya started going a little bit forward, now he's got the extra healing, and Tyler really uh, extending far. Uh, but Tanya's able to push them apart a little bit. The Reinhardt's a bit forward to, uh, to everyone else. So they can they overextend. Punishers overextension. They can. And then that's the Lucio down as well. Unfortunately Tanya's down. But she can only spawn around the corner. Whereas these lot have a fucking half the map to cross. So yeah not bad. Not bad. But. Let's see. Tyler. Making a bit more space. That Zarya shouldn't be lasting long. Oh dear. But Rasmus has to pop his ult unfortunately. But is it oh, isn't quite able to get anyone. But. Mm. Oh well. Somehow their defense ended up. Oh, I uh, must have killed herself. Ah, uh, just. Yeah. Now we have all the blue team coming in. We've got a grav. We've got a. Uh, we've got. F they got fucking everything. They've literally got everything. All right, Camille. No, Rasmus. Remember what I told you. Pressure the Zarya and she'll grab. Okay. So uh, let's see if they can remember Master Rowan's lessons. Come on, team. I've got high expectations of you. No. <gasps> oh, oh, I thought they ate it. I thought they ate it. But to be fair, oh, Kinku keeping everyone... Well, keeping Tyler and Rasmus alive. But they, when you use every single out, it's kind of difficult to do much. But here comes Tyler from spawn. What's he able to get? What's he able to get? Where even is the fucking Tyler? He's going the long way. Oh, what's he going to get? What's he going to get? Oh, you know what? He gets the fire. He'll take that. But I have a feeling he might have been wanting to get the mercy as well. But Tyler cleans up after him. And then his solo altered. So I think... Well, you can't really blame him for that. And then uh, the stall is coming out from Kinku with the clutch May. I always knew she was a May main. And so uh, Valk from uh, Annie just ensures the point is kept. But Oh, thank you for the charge, Diva. That's very kind of you. And, oh, they don't feel like it's, uh, staggering her anymore, though. So, two and, two and a half minutes down, to be fair. Western Koreans and every single ult used by the blue team. I think you cannot complain about that at all. So now you've just got two and a half minutes left to hold them and we've got a shatter coming up from Tanya. I think they've got nothing nothing to stop that, so if you can break down the shield. Notice how both Annas <laughs> have now gone, I think. I think it was a bit ambitious to start off with from both teams, but here we go, just poking away, just poking away. Still no progress being made. Blue team taking their time outside, they've lost half a minute just standing by the fucking door. Like a Oh. All right, now they're pushing in. And Miner, oh dear, and that's unlucky for the Lucio. And then uh, Ryan is put up. Oh dear, that is unlucky. But yeah, ult blocked from Tanya and the thing destroyed by Tyler. I don't think either of them really wanted that, but fuck it. Blue team still retreating, but they're nearly back yet. So Tanya may want to get her shield back up because they're going to be on her ass before long. Tyler doing a good job of just holding them back with the spam. Unable to get anything, but let's have a look. Josh is playing Mercy because they re he realised he can't aim for shit. Uh, so, oh dear. And what does he get? Oh, and two kills from Ziri, but Ziri himself goes down. Uh, Josh with the res because uh, he's in balcony, but so so is Annie. So it's a uh, who c who can last the longer? Uh, both tanks down for both teams, but also Lucio. Oh dear, but unfortunately so is Tyler, that's a lot of spam gone, but now the uh, Rasmus is coming back into the fight as Diva, as is Kinku. Oh, and he goes straight into the dragon, but it's... Oh, he drops the ult in front of the payload. Uh, but anyway, uh, Camille with a visor getting the Pharaoh, you know, we'll take it. But unfortunately he goes down to a Hanzo Storm arrow, and... Uh, oh. Okay. Kinku's still, Kinku still on the race, she obviously was happy with how she did on there. Here's Tyler coming through with the... Oh, that is exactly what you need. Both tanks down, they've got to reset. They've got to reset, but oh, they are going to be coming in with both alts. So, and Western Koreans have very little to stop it, I'm afraid. Okay, 33 seconds. So you have everything coming in from the side of uh, the blue team. The, the alts have been have been disconnected from both teams one time. Uh, one team will have all of them one fight, then the other team will have all of them the next fight. They've, they've been very desynchronized. But anyway, Annie, Annie has got the Valkyrie, so we need we need an Annie carry. She's pulled it out before. Let's see if she can do it this time. Now watch for the Shatter and the Grav. 
Tanya, you you can get the shatter. Lazmus, get the grab. Oh, a, a nice wall by a. Uh, oh dear. Yeah. Oh, but it's overtime on both of them. Camille. Um. Yeah. That was a a good fight you put up, mate. I. <laughs> you uh <laughs> really showed your bravery. So all in all, three three. Both teams forced to overtime, so we've got a minute left. I would be, s I wouldn't be surprised if Western Queens try a cheeky little slambulance, but what, what I'd say from that, bo both both uh, Farrers had a very, uh, very productive session. I think maybe a little bit more counterplay from uh, either team could help that, uh, since not it took them a while really to adjust and get the hit scans going. Both Anna subbed out, so I'll be surprised if we see either of them. And what do you fucking know, slambulance, I called it. So. Let me plan this out. Western Queens, start off here, go through here. They see all the people there, what they got, Ryan, D oh, Bastion, those fucking bastards. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine, that's good actually. So, Western Queens, come around here, notice the Bastion, fuck that, go in here. Now, they slowly rotate their way around and get onto the point here. The Bastion, the Bastion is probably set up here, so if he was smart, he will reset to here. But, if he's not, Western Korean should be able to rotate and then dive on him. Maybe get a nice juicy hook from Camille, but I don't know, we'll see. Lasmus on the D.Va, Tyler on the Zarya. Don't, don't get used to it, mate, as soon as I'm back in, but she's mine. Now, Western Korean's running out the gates. Well, they've used the scout arrow, so they know they've got the uh, the quadruple tank comp, but that mine does absolutely fuck all. Now, Western Koreans running straight through. Oh, the Mercy is right behind Tyler, but he doesn't notice. Okay. And Chan is unfortunately pinned. That's his Kinku. Reset, guys. Reset, guys. You've got 40 seconds. Just everyone die. Camille, why are you, why are you taking a drink? Just die. Just die. Alright, you got 35 seconds. Okay, that didn't go well at all. Oh, they switched to Bastion. I guess I'm retarded. Uh, okay, so we've got... Oh dear. Junkrat almost got his ult already. Yeah, that could really shut down the push here. I guess he got a lot of spam coming from that one there. Anyway, Western Koreans resetting up again. Junkrat in the room on the right with the Mercy. If they turn around, they can... Oh dear. Oh, but, oh okay, he, get, he gets the, the Lucio. We'll take that. But Tanya's down as well, unfortunately. And everyone else is down from the Shatter. Yeah, this isn't going to go well. See, fucking Junkrats. We just... Western Koreans, like... Nothing they can do against it. And Kinku's not much longer. Oh dear. Josh locks his way to life after that hook, but yeah. Western Koreans. Best they can hope for is a draw now. I think we need to need to figure out what to do against this uh this junk rat spam because it really is fucking us. Anyway. What are we gonna go on defence? Hmm. Yeah, Western Queens on defense. Oh, yeah, they are. Kinku on Widow. Yep, good decision. Tylo on Torb. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Uh, this is the kind of innovative thinking we need. So come on, boys, bring the bring the trophy home. Kinku, what are you doing? Stop throwing and going healer and get back to your own fucking Widow. Okay. So. Ryan, ha oh no, and Arisa, I was going to say. And Arisa, Hog, uh, Cowboy, and Junkrat. So pretty much a mirror pick of last time for the defense, except they've got, we've gone for McCree over Hanzo. Annie looking slick in a black watch. <gasps> Bamboo, are you chatting shit? You better not be fucking Nana... No, Nana doesn't love them. Nan thinks they're all fucking cunts and thinks Western Koreans is about to fist them. So come on boys, prove me right. Alright, Tyler just laying down the spam. Cheeky little trap down there. Are they taking their fucking time or what? Oh, okay, no, they've, they've gone quad tank as well. Those unoriginal bastards, I bet that was Josh's idea. I bet that was fucking Josh's idea. Alright, either way, they've taken so fucking long, they've only got one push to get in there, they've only got 30 seconds left, so if they don't get it on the first try, they are basically fucked. Okay. I don't know what the f there's a lot of screaming, but not much dying going on, unfortunately there is an Arisa dead. 
Oh shit. Yeah, that's not going well. Come on, Tyler with the Tyler with the bomb to save it. Tyler! Tyler! Ah! Tyler fucking saving the game! Now get your ass back on the point and kill this fucking they're half their team. Oh my god, he does as well. Oh my god, Annie, Annie, okay. And he takes down the... Oh, no, no, no. Someone get onto point. Someone get onto point. Rasmus, Rasmus. Oh, Tanya just gets back onto point and pushes him up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're going to do it. The hat coming in from Rasmus to save it so he can't get his thing back. And then Tanya just clear it up. Come on. They've only got the squishies. Josh, uh, Josh on the fucking Moira because he can't aim for shit. Camille coming in with the Reaper. Fuck them on. Fuck them all up. Fuck them all up. Do whatever you do. Do not get off point. Tyler bitch slaps Josh like the little bitch he is. Kinku pushing the fucking soldier away they don't want anything to do with him oh my god oh my god Tyler he is the kind of player you need if you want to draw in overwatch that is like he's a necessity all right now this is fucking bullshit all right uh, we know what the player of the game was fucking incredible absolutely amazing all right we'll take that